Hello everyone, this is Lynette with The Skin Candy. Thank you so much for joining us again today on another one of our soap making adventures. Today is the third soap of our Valentine series. This will also be in one of the gift sets that we will offer um, of a bath bomb, soap, and a lotion. So this one is one that I've been wanting to remake for a long time and it is so yummy. This fragrance is good in everything we've tried it in. In lotion, body butter, candles, wax melts, bath bombs, soap. It soaps marvelously, it retains its scent, and it is great with any color choice that you decide that you want to use with it. And that fragrance is the Blue Volcano Dupe or Type. And the one I'm using today is actually from Nature's Garden. So we're going to be using our um, Volcano, Blue Volcano fragrance oil. Into my oils we have, um, this is a no palm recipe again. We're going to try this one more time. I did up the amount of my water in my lye solution this time. So I'm using 38% water instead of the um, around 19 to 20% water. In my oils, you can see there's some stuff in here that's kind of uh, sinking down to the bottom. That is my coconut milk powder, my kale and clay, and my colloidal oats. So for our colors, we are going to be doing a mass of colors. And if you guys remember one of the very first videos we did, probably about this time last year, we did a 25 pound slab of Volcano. And we used all these colors that we're gonna be using again. I'm not doing a 25 pound slab. I am going to be just doing our regular two pound mold for this one. But most likely I'm gonna to have to be upgrading soon to our five pound mold because we are selling soap like crazy now. So probably gonna be updating to that so you'll be able to see us making it in our five pound mold, which will be fun. So on to the colors. We are using, I am using some neons along with some other colors. So I've got Flirt and the neon pink, I think it's called Pink Flamingo from Mad Micah's. This is Tennis Ball Breaker and Taxi Cab. Here we have, I can't remember the green now, but it's the green um, neon from Mad Micah's along with Maniacal P. Then we have Great Knee High in here. And then we have the, I think this is called cheesy poof I think with the neon with um tangerine dream oh and the yellow was a uh, tennis ball breaker and then in here is our blue I'll leave it down in the description box below I can't remember which one it was I think it's Tahitian teal so I've just got these just a little bit dispersed in just some water and they've just been soaking and I'm kind of trying that out seeing if the water works a little bit better than oils and then for the top, we're going to be using this iridescent glitter. I showed this one of the other ones that I got. I just put it in a little, um, I'll leave the link down below where I bought these. It came in like a pack of 24 or something. And I'm kind of converting all my ones, except for the ones that are in the spray, I'm converting all my glitters to this. And so this was actually, um, I think this is Nina Simone glitter from Mad Micah's. Yes, I'm a Mad Micah's fan. I love them. I love their quality. I love that they are ethically sourced. They come really fast. They're a very good price. I really do enjoy them. To my lye water is just the sodium hydroxide distilled water, a couple tablespoons of cane sugar, and then some sodium, a couple teaspoons of sodium lactate. Sodium lactate just helps the bar harden, helps it get out of the silicone molds a lot easier so it doesn't stick to the sides. So I think without further ado, let's get soaping.
going to add any glitter to this. I am loving the top. I am loving the swirl. I'm really excited to see what it turns out to be on the inside after how I did that pour. Not sure. We'll see. I've never done that before. I am not going to bring this up to, I'm going to try to bring the camera down. And that's about as far as I can get. Let me see if I can bring this up without slopping. Look at that top. How cute is that? Oh, I can't wait to make some bath bombs to match this. So I am going to spray this with some rubbing alcohol because it does have a little bit extra water in it. I am worried that I'm gonna get some soda ash on there. So I'll probably steam it in the morning before I cut this. And we will be back in about 18 to 24 hours for the cut. And until then, we'll see you later. Hey everybody, it's Lynette with the Skin Candy. We are back to cut the blue volcano. And I just pulled this out of the mold. It's been about four days and it's still just a titch soft, but look at those stripes so far. So this is the side that I poured from, so it's got some little muddling. We'll clean off the top because it got a little bit full, but I'm excited to see what's on the inside. I would like to introduce you to my new soap cutter. I haven't named it yet, but this soap cutter was a birthday present to myself. So it is a one inch multi-bar cutter and I got this from Bud's Workshop on Etsy. And I will tell you right now, it is the best cutter. I love all these cutter cutters. I have two of his, I have a one and a quarter inch and then I have the one inch. We decided to, <clears throat> I decided to buy a one inch because we have so many orders of soap all the time and each client wants them different widths. Sometimes they want them to be more weight. So we want to cut a thicker bar, but they want this size. It just depends. So I am going to cut this and we're going to see what's on the inside. I'm excited to see. And I have not used this soap yet. You could, this is my maiden voyage for the soap. So I think I'm only gonna be able to get one cut off the edge. So we'll do it that way. Yeah, we'll just get one cut. Okay. Ooh, it cuts like butter. Okay, let's take some out of the middle and see what happened on the inside. Oh my gosh. Look at that. And then the top. <gasps> oh. I am in love. Oh! Everyone is different. Everyone is looking different. Oh my gosh, and the end pieces. How cool is that? Oh my gosh, I'm loving these. I am so glad I decided to do these colors and I decided to do this fragrance, the Blue Volcano. This to me just is just perfect for Blue Volcano. Oh my gosh, look at that. It looks kind of like he has eyes. Do you see a face there? I see eyes and like a nose. There's his nose, his eyes. That's funny that that came out like that. Oh, so excited. All right, these will be part of our Valentine's Day set. It will come with a soap, a bath bomb, and a lotion, body cream, four ounce body cream. And those will be going up in the shop within the next couple of days and we'll be ready for purchase. And we will only have a limited number of sets available. So get them while you can. I can't decide which one I like best. Maybe, I don't know. Let's see if we turn the other way. Nope, they've got two different separate bars right next to each other and look totally different. Oh, I love it, love it. So. Until then, my friends, we will see you later. Bye.